Alrighty. Hi everyone. I'm Justin, also known as Snowy, as you may see right here. Um, today I am showing you how to put on a Glow Series slick wrap case for the iPhone 5. This is what the package looks like when you get it. And this is all the goodies that come in it. Um, here are all the the covers. This is the back, front, and then the sides and optional tops on the sides, tops and bottoms on the sides. So, this is a fairly simple process. Um, it also comes with actually a screen protector that goes and it fits perfectly over where the screen is so that it doesn't cover anything else. And then you also get a slick wraps microfiber cloth. Now, something cool about this is if you mess up, you can just take it off and do it again. It's not going to ruin anything. Well, first of all, I have a screen pr protector on already. So I'm going to go ahead and take that off. And then once you've done that, you can go ahead. And actually, it's best to start on the back of the phone. It's easiest. Go ahead and unwrap your microfiber cloth. Okay, now you're going to want to wipe your phone off and try and get all the dust and fingerprints off if, that you want. Okay, and when you're done, you can go ahead and take off the back. Comes off fairly simple. And if you want, there's an Apple logo right here. If you want to take that out, you can or leave it in. I'm going to take it out. You just pop it right out. very easy to do and then the easiest thing to do is I'm gonna flip it upside down like this is to actually go ahead and start from the top so line up the camera and the flash and the top edge so. Once you think you've got it on, go ahead and push it down. And it goes on nice and easy. And then you can just push it down and it locks into place. Okay, now the back is done. So, now you can go over to the front. Go ahead and wipe off all the fingerprints and dust. So now we're going to go ahead and take off the front piece. And you can just go ahead and punch out where the screen is going to go. Fairly simple. And then you can either keep the home button or you can take it out. I'm going to go ahead and take out the home button too. Now what you can do, the easiest way to do this one is to line it up from the bottom to start at the home screen. So you line up the bottom with the home screen and the bottom edge. And then don't worry about the sides yet. Go ahead and line up the top section with the sensors. And then once you've got that, then you can go ahead and push down your sides. It's nice and easy. Fairly simple to do. All right, and then you got the top. You got the top. There you go. You got the front and the back now. And then we can work on the sides. So, actually, let's go ahead and do the bottom of the phone first. 
Now what's cool is there are these antenna bars on the sides that you can line it up with. Let me see. I don't know. It's kind of hard to see. But if you have a phone, you might be able to see it here. See, there are these antenna bars that you can line them up with. Now, you can go ahead and take the bottom off first. And punch out these little punch outs. Not very hard to do. Alright. And once you've done that, go ahead and line up your edge with the antenna bar. And once you got it, just go ahead and pull it over. And go ahead and push it down to the other side. And then once you got it, you can go ahead and lock it in. Okay. And then you can do the top. So we're going to go ahead and remove the top piece right here. And we're going to go ahead and punch out the little, little punch out. And again, we're going to line it up with the antenna bars here. All right. Not too hard to do. And if they don't stick a little bit, you can blow dry just a little bit. Just put take a blow dryer to it. But not too much. And then you can go ahead and do the sides. I'm going to go ahead and take out the little inserts before I take it off this time. Now go ahead and line it up again with the antenna bars. Once you have it, just set it down gently and go ahead and rub it on. And then, last but not least, you have the other side, the SIM card side. Now there's a SIM card cutout that you can or can take out if you want to or not. I'm going to go ahead and leave it in. Now, you also line this up with the antenna bars on this side of the phone. And then once you have it, you just push it down. And then, once you're done with that, this is how it looks like.